What's up guys, this is Matt with Flagstaff Camera and today we're gonna to talk about another reason your film might be coming back blank. Let's jump in. So you got your film back from the lab and it's blank. There's kind of two different ways your film comes back blank from the lab. The first is it comes back blank and there's nothing on it. There was never any pictures on it because the film was never pulled through the camera. We did a separate video talking about this and we'll link that up here. The other way your film comes back blank from the lab is that it's either totally black, completely exposed to light or close. So when that happens, you get your film back and it's just, there's just an endless amount of it, of just black film, right? So we don't want that. And that usually happens from you being out, enjoying your life. You're not exactly sure if you've got film in the camera. So you just, whoops. When that happens, right? Depending on how long you have the camera open, a couple of different things may happen. So I'm mid roll here. You can see I've got a bunch of film taken up on the take up spool. I've got a bunch of film waiting to be exposed and I've still got some film left in the canister. Anything that's left in here, probably going to be fine. Everything else is either going to be completely ruined or partially ruined. You'll see light leaks, you'll see black sections of film, which will show up as white sections in your prints or scans. So it turns out there's a really easy way to figure out if you have film in your camera to prevent this from ever happening. And with any camera that has a manual rewind knob, all you got to do is pull on that rewind knob when you pick up the camera. If it stops, you got film in the camera, Hopefully you remember what your ISO was set to. Hopefully you set it every time you load your film and you're ready to just keep shooting. Now keep in mind, if you managed to open the camera, your film counter will reset to zero, which means you can just ignore that film counter for the rest of your film. As soon as your camera no longer winds and shoots and winds and shoots, as soon as that camera stops winding easily, stop, don't force it. Just go ahead and press your rewind button, rewind your film, because you're done. After that, you're ready to reload your new roll and move on. That's it. Thanks for joining us for another round of tips and tricks on film photography here at Flagstaff Camera. If you have anything else you want us to chat about, any comments, questions, concerns, if you have a better way to do something uh, than my way, just drop that in the comments below. And until then, we'll see you in the next one.